All right, I'm opening this one. I've had this one sitting in my uh, on my desk right here for about three, four weeks now. And I just need to get it. I just need to open this. This is a mirror. This is chaos in the ocean. The name is so intriguing to me. Ooh, I like the uh, texture on the box. It's like a cardboard. Oh, did you hear that? That's magnetic cap. That means I can't pick it up by the cap. Ooh. Wow. Okay, so this is pretty cool. This like imprinted texture and it's almost like this rubbery texture on here. And you can see like the name of the fragrance. Magnetic cap. Chaos in the ocean. Already 10 out of 10 for the presentation. This looks legit. This looks really, really good. I'm actually very impressed. Atomizer is okay. Atomizer is pretty good. You know, it sprays, spritz off pretty good and it's got a little nice, um, you know, punch to it whoa this is this is amber extreme man wow this is potent um i don't know what this is a clone of at all but this is heavy heavy amber extreme so this is wow uh, so this is um ambroxan and amber extreme mixed fresh citrus in here top notes are bergamot lemon uh calone uh hedione seaweed base notes of Ambroxan, cedar, and musk. Yeah, this has ambroxan, amber extreme, and a lot of musk. The musk is like ethylene brassolate. I'm actually kind of disappointed with this one. Uh, so let me get get this right. This is gonna. This is a beast of a performer. Do you hear that? Someone's drilling outside. Hopefully, he's not messing up my review. I'm just gonna get through the review because I don't know what they're doing out there. Anyway, um, so this one has this um, Amber Extreme note in here. And what, and I know a lot of people don't know what an Amber Extreme is, but it's this really potent Amber Wood smell to it. It's very potent. And you're gonna go nose blind to this one. Um, I'm already going nose blind to it. Based off of my experience with working with perfumery, this is Ambroxan, Amber Extreme, and a lot of citrus dihydromersinol. It's very potent too. I don't know what this is cloning. I should probably look it up. Hey, it's on Fragrantica. I did not, you, you never know with, with a mirror if they're gonna be on Fragrantica or not. But yeah, fresh marine, azonic, aquatic. I'm shocked that they don't have Magmira. Yeah, okay, I could see that. Yeah, it's definitely like that. Um, definitely like that. It's very extreme though. It's it's really extreme. It's got a lot of amber extreme in here, um, and it, I, it's hard to describe. But it's this like very potent, very powerful amber note that's really it lasts a long time, and it's very projecting. We when you mix that with ambroxan, it's the same kind of thing that that happens in Sauvage. That's why Sauvage lasts a, such a long time is because it has those two molecules that just push it off. Anyway, it's really good. I wanna, this is one of those fragrances that probably needs the air to kind of like breathe in. Um, you know, it's gonna be hard judging it when you're like sitting up close because the way that this one is crafted really seems like it needs the air, the environment to experience it, you know. But I I really like it right now. It's it's definitely heavy ambroxan, amber wood, um, that kind of thing. But, um, you know, it is fresh, it, it's, a zonic, it's, you know, aquatic, um, but it's very powerful. I would say that this is a good everyday wear and just like going about your day, maybe like one or two sprays. I don't know how this one performs. It could perform like, you know, bad, but based off just smelling it, I don't think that this one is a bad performer by no means. Um, I think this one would be a little bit too much for some people. So maybe one or two sprays, uh, very marine, aquatic, um, salty and it's got this just freshness about it that's just pushing off but amber extreme is very present i think that they did an awesome job with this one i i really do uh you know i'm bad mouthing it here talking trash about it throwing it in the dirt and but i think it's pretty nice i i do i i think it's a very well versed it's fresh clean amber and broxen aquatic calone kind of thing I like it a lot. It is really nice. Have you guys tried this one? Let me know down in the comments down below. And um, I would love to hear your thoughts on it. 
I like it. I'm kind of indifferent about it. I would say that it's probably six, seven out of 10. I would probably, let's just do a seven out of 10 um, for this guy, 7.1, 7 7 7.1 for this. Thanks for watching the video, guys. We will see you next time.